Thank you. Uh, I'm from <coughs> Research and Development in Topcon Healthcare Solutions. And today I'm going to re uh, present our recent research on the comparison of this, uh, this area results of a swab source OCT and a spectral domain OCT in patients with vinyl hair and glaucoma. Here is the financial disclosure for all the authors. To begin with, I want to uh, briefly introduce the disk detection method in OCT. Uh, the first one is sclerosing disk detection. It is to detect the sclerosing margin where the disk area is defined as the inside of the sclerosing. This method was originally developed to mimic the traditional 2D disk, uh, optic disk photography, disk margin detection. It is wide available in Topcon commercial OCD products like uh, Trident, Mastro, Atlantis, etc. And another very uh, popular disk detection method is Brooks membrane opening based disk detection. It is to detect the Brooks membrane opening points. Uh, Zeiss and Heidelberg has the uh, BMO-based disk, disk detection. And for Topcon, our BMO-based disk detection is still under development. Uh, here's the image il illustration of the BMO point and the uh, sclerosing disk point. So on the left part, the BMO disk point is the same as the sclerosing point. And on the right part, because of the existence of border tissue, uh, oh, sorry, the BMO point is different from the sclerosing point. As a result, the BMO area is, small, uh, uh, is larger than the sclerosing disc area. Uh, to compare the different disc detection methods in swap source OCT and spectral domain OCT, we conduct a uh, study in patients with myopia and glaucoma. And the three methods uh, we're going to compare is the top contract and BMO, top contract and sclerosing, and the serious BMO based de uh, detections. Uh, this study was conducted in three clinical sites, and after removal of unaccepted data sets, we have 52 eyes left, and their vision field is in a large range. For Trident, 382 wide vertical scans are left for analysis, and that is seven to eight reputations per eye. And for Sirius, there are 301 uh, disc cube horizontal scans used for analysis. That is five to six scans per eye. Here's the list of the software version that we used. Um, to compare the agreement, we calculate the average disk uh, area using all accepted datasets and the diamond regression and blend outman plots using the first accepted scan for each eye. Here's the result for the average disk area. Uh, as you can see, Trident BMO has the largest disk area, whereas Sirius BMO has the smallest disk, uh, disk area. And uh, Sirius BMO is more closer to Trident sclerosing than to Trident BMO. Uh, here's the demo regression, and on the left, uh, the, uh, there is the uh, agreement between Sirius BMO and Trident BMO, and on the right, uh, there's, uh, it's the agreement between Sirius BMO and Trident sclerosing. And the right, oh, sorry, and the right dot line is the identi uh, identity line, and the slope for the left is 1.18, and the slope for the right is uh, 0.98. Uh, so this result reveals that the uh, Sirius BMO has a better agreement with Trident uh, sclerosing. Uh, the blend outman plots, uh, on the left it shows the difference between Trident BMO and Sirius BMO, and on the right it shows the difference between Trident sclerosing and Sirius BMO. Um, as you can see, the right has smaller difference. Uh, we further investigate the disk detection on B scan level. Uh, the left is the series and the right is uh, Trident BMO. Uh, yeah. As you can see, series detects all the way down to this point, whereas Trident BMO detects this point, which co uh, corresponding to this, this point. Uh, both of the B, uh, B scans are interpolated scans, so um, their quality is not that good. Um, we have a uh, radio scan with better resolution and eight reputations. So you can clearly see the end of uh, uh, Brooks membrane layer and the existence of the border tissue. So we, uh, we think this is the 
uh, Brooks membrane opening point. Uh, here is another example. Again, Sirius detects this point. You may not see clearly. And Trident detects this, po this point, which corresponds to, to this point. And uh, the radio scan with higher resolution. So for this study, uh, we draw the following conclusions. The optic disk BMO measurements from different OCT in instruments uh, did not agree and may now be used interchangeably. To be more specific, uh, different disk detection methods identify different disk contour locations in the anatomy, which may l l uh, lead to possible different clinical implications. There are two disk, detections, uh, de uh, disk detection methods that are available not available, that's uh, evaluated in Trident, uh, which is the sclerosin-based disk detection, which is commercially available, and the BMO-based disk detection is still under development. And Sirius has um, one disk detection method, which is BMO-based, and their results closely resemble those from the Trident sclerosin method, and we will further investigate this, uh, this findings. Thank you. Thank you for your attention.